G'day everyone, Raid Zero AU, and welcome back to another episode of Subnautica. This is episode 8, and today I thought we might head out and see. We're just going to be looking for things to scan today. Really like to find the fragments for the Seamoth, if possible. Need to be a bit mindful of the sand sharks. So, keep an eye out. Hopefully we can find something to scan. A few sand sharks around here. Let's go up get some oxygen. Caution. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Going on there. What's happened here? It's all glitched out. Yeah. All right. Ooh. Not quite sure what happened there, guys. It was all a bit glitched out, but it's okay. Something here. It's the battery charger. No, one more of those. What's that? Trash cans. Yay, just what I always wanted. We might as well grab it. New blueprint acquired. Caution, 30 seconds. Let's of grab some more remaining. oxygen. Ow. Bloody sand sharks. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Uh, change batteries. Okay. Got something there. Fire reactor. Unlock the fire reactor, that's good. Anything down in here? Mm. Bar table. Oh, Jesus. Sharks. Caution. Didn't end up getting the bar table, but not that bothered. No, let's keep going. What's that down there? I reckon that might be a piece of the sea moth. Yep. Awesome. One of five. Pulsion cannon. One of three. Oh, leave me alone. Oh, 
we can get the sea moth, that'll be awesome. That'll make things so much easier. Alright, better use the first aid kit again. Put this wreck over here. Gotta be another piece of the sea moth, surely. Uh, what's that in the. Oh, leave me alone! Another piece there. Let's go grab that. Where are we going? Three or five. What's this down here? Modification station. Two or three. Going for power, 20%. Uh, I've got another battery on me. Seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay. Let's change the batteries. There's another piece of the seam off there. Can't get that without being eaten. Four or five, one to go. Sand shark there. Alright, let's get up out of here for a moment. You can attack the uh, sand sharks, but. Um, Dehydration detected. Alright. Yeah. signs stabilizing. Something down there. Oh, a battery. Get in this wreck. So many sand sharks around. A couple of things in here. Battery charger. Awesome. That should give us the battery charger. Yep. Propulsion cannon. Propulsion cannon unlocked. 30 battery charger. We'll do it just for the uh, titanium. Seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh! There we go. Alright, let's get out of here. Go get some oxygen. So we need one more piece 
for the Seamoth. Emergency. We've got the battery charger, which is awesome. Alright, there's got to be another piece around somewhere. Plenty of stuff here to uh, to scan. There's really only the one thing that I want at this point to make it a successful trip. That's not it. Eighteen percent left in the power stokes. And here, so battery charger. Thirty seconds. Battery charger. Not having much luck finding this last piece of the sea moth, so emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen yeah. remaining. Alright. There we go. What's that down there? That looks like a piece of sea moth to me. that one there. No, it's not. Bloody hell. It's starting to get a bit dark down here, isn't it? Altered me. Yep. All right, so we're heading into night time. Chug. All right. Well, thinking, guys, we've done okay. Haven't got need one more piece for the sea moth, but I'm thinking what I'm going to do is I'm going to head back and do the battery charger. Um, actually, I should have I should have another battery actually because we did pick one up, didn't we? Ah, there we go. Alright, well, let's keep looking while we've got this battery. It'd be nice if we could grab the uh... Caution, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. It'd be nice if we could grab the uh, last piece of the seam off. Caution, mild dehydration detected. Alright. intake recommended. Uh, let's just have a look at... A blueprint, so sea moth, yeah, four or five, two or three of the modification table, or bar table, not that bothered by. Alright. 
you guys have probably already spotted a piece of uh, the sea moth that I haven't seen. But we'll keep looking. be another piece of it somewhere around here. to give me emergency 10 seconds of oxygen remaining oh, I might have left this too late yep bugger all right that's what happens when you ignore the 30 second warning uh, what do I lose Probably lost a bit of titanium or something like that. Yeah. That's okay. Right, well, what I'm going to do is going to have a look in here and have a look at. No, we're not. What we'll do is what do we need for battery charger? Two titanium, one glass, one copper wire, one computer chip. All right, shouldn't be too hard. Uh, computer chip. We need some silver for, don't we? Silver ore. Don't know that we got any silver ore. Uh, copper. Got gold and lead. Uh, no silver. Alright, let's just pop those in there. Alright, so we need some silver ore. from this thing and then uh, there's a couple of okay. my limestone chunks here titanium Where's the other one copper so, bioreactor fragment I think we've already got that haven't we yeah Okay. Come on, give me some silver. Maybe stay away from those dudes. Let's grab that while we're here. Titanium. Lead. Yeah, I heard you. Ow. Oh. 
Hopper. Silver. There we go. That's, that's what we needed. Grab a little bit of ore, uh, or a bit of um, quartz while we're out here, if I can see some. But the next thing, trying to find quartz. some oxygen because we do need some glass and yeah, there's some quartz down in here So hopefully we should have everything we need to be able to make the battery charger. Uh, so actually what we need is copper, titanium, silver, uh, we need the table coral easy to get, just need to fight, just need to locate some, there it is, just grab some of this, okay, it should give us everything we need to make the uh, computer chip, to chip. Uh, now let's just check what we need. Uh, copper wire and some glass and one glass. So, all right. uh, copper wire and a glass. Go. So, yeah, we can put that next to next to that. All right. And what we can what we can do is grab. Batteries, two there, you in there. Ah, yeah, I reckon it holds four. So, there we go. So they can all be charging. Now, how's our fish going in here? Got doing okay, doing okay. Might leave them for a little bit longer and let them uh, let them breed a bit more. We've got the uh, if I, can I pick the cluster? Actually, it's is it the clusters that we want? Or not. Oh, look, we'll grab 
two of them. So that should provide us with enough for those uh, clusters that, if we need them. Um, yeah, happy with that. Uh, I might just grab a paper, to be honest. Just so we could do with some uh, food. So didn't quite get everything that we wanted. Um, still need that extra, the extra piece for the sea moth. Um, let's just have a look here and see. Well, actually, easier to just to bring that up. Uh, I don't know. This would be in the... What I'm looking for is, I just want to see if we've actually... I'm pretty sure that we did get the mobile vehicle base. So we need a titanium ingot, some lubricant, and a power cell. Okay, so... Power cell is two batteries and some silicon rubber. Easy. How are we going for power in that? 29%. These are all charging pretty nicely. And I reckon I've got another one here. I've got two batteries here. So basically I can use these empty batteries to make the power cell. So that's all good. Uh, Reginald. Reginald. It'll be the second part of lunch. Alright, so I think in the next episode what we're going to look to do is definitely want to find that last piece for the um, for the sea moth and um, we'll build the mobile vehicle bay so we can then look at building the uh, sea moth and uh, that will aid with exploration a huge amount so so yeah I'm gonna call the video here hope you've enjoyed what you've watched if you have please leave a like and subscribe and look forward to seeing you all next time I'm Raid Zero AU signing out